Welcome to the Talon Fast video series. Today, we'll be taking a look at Talon's automated performance benchmarking utility, Office Bench. This tool is used to demonstrate the performance benefits of the Talon Fast solution and is designed to execute a series of basic file operations on a customer provided test data set made up of Microsoft Office files such as Excel, PowerPoint, and Word. In this overview, We'll demonstrate how to capture performance metrics from key Microsoft Office applications by running the Office Bench utility from a client workstation in each of the branch Office sites that contain a TalonFast Edge instance. This will provide you a great overview on how Talon performs compared to native WAN performance. The exercise enables organizations to make a well-educated decision towards consolidation of branch Office storage by centralizing unstructured data in one place while leveraging the Talon Fast Intelligent File Caching technology at the edge. Before you begin, you'll need some test data files, as well as exclusive remote access to a typical client workstation in the branch office that you'd provide to your end users. This will need to be able to access and have read-write permissions to the test data and be able to map a drive. For the test files, You'll be looking for three to five files of varying size in each format, Excel, PowerPoint, and Word, for a total of nine to 15 files. We recommend the files be one to five megabytes for small files, five to 15 megabytes for medium files, 15 to 50 megabytes for large files, and 50 plus megabytes for extra large files. Depending on your typical user workflows, your dataset may vary. It's important to note that all files selected for testing should be self-contained and do not utilize macros, linked workbooks or formulas, password protection, etc., as these will interfere with the automated nature of the Office Bench utility. It's advised that you open the files manually to ensure that they are suitable for testing before you begin. The user workstation should have your standard Microsoft Office installation available on the client workstation in each of the branch Office sites. Please be sure that you open each application manually to ensure that you have correct licensing, cleared any pop-up messages, and have set the applications to open files without being in protected view. Now that you're ready to start with the Office Bench testing, you'll need to download the zip file containing the Office Bench utility from the Talon website. Copy this zip file to the backend file server where your test data has been copied to. After unzipping the package, you'll find an Office Bench folder, which contains a folder for each Microsoft Office application, a folder for your results, the Office Bench script, and a file with instructions for running the utility. Copy your test documents into their respective folders directly on the backend file server in the data center. You can then access the branch office workstation and create a drive mapping to the native WAN path to the Office Bench folder on the backend file server. Once the drive has been mapped, open a command prompt and change directory to the new drive mapping. From here, you'll run the command cscript talonbench.vbs5. The number that you enter can be adjusted to run fewer or more iterations of the test. We recommend 5 as it provides adequate performance metrics without taking too long. After pressing Enter, you'll see a time-stamped Results Excel file being created on your screen. The utility will then begin opening, editing, saving, and closing the applications and test files one by one. As it does so, it will record the time for each operation to complete in milliseconds in the Results Excel document. It is advised to simply leave the workstation alone and allow the testing to complete. As this is a native WAN connection the first time, this process may take a long time to complete, especially when there are large files involved. Once finished, we see the completed results document, which you can modify the file name to indicate which branch office was used and that it was a WAN test. The file can be moved into the results folder for later reference. A new drive mapping will be created, but this time you'll use the local branch office's Talon Fast Edge to access the data. 
We'll create a drive mapping using the local fast data virtual file share, drill down to the office bench folder on the back end and map a new drive. Just before we map the drive, we can open each of the test data folders to ensure that the test data is visible, but also has the cold file indicator on each file. The cold files are marked with a gray X to note the data is available, but has not been cached at the branch office site yet. Once you've verified all test data is cold, you can change the directory in the command prompt window to the new drive mapping, which will be the optimized Talon path. As before, you'll enter the command cscript talonbench.vbs5, and an Excel results file will be generated. The same process will repeat for file opening, editing, saving, and closing on each of the test files. However, you'll notice that this time just the first iteration of tests is cold performance. Each subsequent iteration of tests will be utilizing the Talon Intelligent File Cache, Delta Differencing, and Compression and Streaming mechanisms to optimize file performance. Once this is finished, we can see the completed results document and we'll modify the file name to indicate which branch office was used and that it was a Talon test. This file can be moved into the results folder for later reference. Your Talon Solutions Engineer will work with you to aggregate this information into an easy to read format. If you have any questions or would like more information, please see our website or contact us through our social media channels. Thanks for watching and have a great day.